Tonight, America chose Sawyer Fredericks to win NBC's The Voice. Our guy, Michigan's Joshua Davis, took third. Oh, yeah, we heard a big oh in the newsroom. Well, <laughs> once again, Kristen Lowe from our Traverse City affiliate is live in Hollywood. So, Kristen, what's next for Joshua? Well, Brian and Marley, I had a chance to speak with Joshua earlier today, and he said he's been writing throughout this whole process, so you can expect an album coming up from him in the near future, and we're all very excited for that. But today, what a day for Joshua Davis. You know, he started off getting one of his original songs in the top nine on iTunes, a song that he wrote about the state of Michigan. It's a huge deal. He went on to perform with Sheryl Crow, a superstar, who he said he was so excited to perform with because of their similar backgrounds in Americana roots music and he won a car so not too shabby not the ending that many people were hoping for for our home state guy but as he told me earlier he misses Michigan he misses being home with his family singing his own songs in long sets and just the kind of slower pace of life so the good news with all this is that he can get back to that sooner Brian Marley uh, he did us all proud, that's for sure. Win or lose, he did a great he job. He did. He sure did. We'll have a good mm -hmm. welcome home for him, too. All right, thank you, Kristen.